Where children go to Madison Public Schools, they'll start next week. So will the hot weather impact their first day? WMTV's Marcus Arsvold is here to tell you whether it will. Mm -hmm. The Madison Metropolitan School District teachers are the only ones in the classrooms now preparing those classrooms. So they are hoping they are inside the buildings. Hope for, for some without AC. It's hot, but for some in the new buildings, there will be AC. It's no secret, it's hot outside into MMSD. It's no surprise. I'm glad that the hot weather is this week and not the first week of school. Michael Herding is the Interim Building Services Senior Executive and he acknowledges some students won't have air conditioning in their buildings next week. Uh, but we will uh, maximize rotating people into uh, cooled spaces, encourage people to stay hydrated, take breaks, uh, work to have fans in the area. Um, and avoid prolonged um, exposure to the sun and heat. But new this year, the four main high schools and three other schools will have AC thanks to the 2020 referendum passed by taxpayers. I'm guessing that uh, we will have very excited students uh, as they come and explore the new spaces. It's an expensive and time-consuming project to add AC to 60-year-old buildings, so Herding hopes the 2024 referendum in November passes for more dollars like in 2020. Our buildings, most of them have boiled and so hot water is run throughout the building. So to convert that to air conditioning, you have to run additional duct work throughout the school. Regardless of who has or doesn't have AC, he says it's going to be a great year. The heat doesn't stop that. Uh, this is Wisconsin and we're used to the seasons and uh, we make adjustments as needed. If the November 2024 referendum passes, the school is hoping to add central air to, the, to 10 additional buildings. The district says this ask won't surprise taxpayers because they say they informed people back in 2020 that they would need more money. Live in the studio, Marcus Arzabal, WMTV 15 News.